a local here weekly vlog entry on a monday um this weekend just gone i didn't have any women's super league action uh because birmingham which is my resident spot we were away at west ham um would have maybe looked at freelancing at villa but they were away as well so um i jumped on the uh rugby double header at the coventry arena uh, which was the men first of all at three o'clock versus northampton and then the women at quarter past five against gloucestershire great day historic day of a double bill Coventry Arena, great day in rugby, got some decent photos, I'll pop on the end. Um, next up for me is Wednesday evening, I'm going to St Andrews to photo Birmingham women against Brighton women in Continental Cup action uh, before a big international break. Uh, I think it's about a four week break for the women's game, so yeah. Um, I'm gonna have to find some other stuff to shoot. There's a, I'm hoping there's a wasps game at Coventry next week. Wasps men. I'm hoping I'll be able to get on that. If not, I'll have to seek something else. Um, you know, nobody give plates you things to photograph events or sports to photograph a lot of the time. I'm having to to look up fixtures, look up what's going on sports wise, send out applications for accreditation. Stuff like that, you know, you've got to put a bit in to get a bit. So, yeah. Um, thing that annoyed me yesterday, there was no media room or plugs pitch side. Um, which there are sometimes, there aren't sometimes. But it was a long day, so my laptop conked out for the women's game. Um, it's normally got a really good battery life. Um you know, I normally get four or five hours out of it, which I did covering the men's game before the women's game. Um, but yeah, it's on a long day, like cricket and stuff, it's not good enough. And in the winter months, it's even shorter. So I finally got round to ordering a laptop power bank off Amazon that's arriving tomorrow. Um, it's a big power bank and it's got a mains plug on it, which is why it's big. So it'll charge the laptop. So um, that's cost quite a bit. I'm glad that's coming tomorrow. Um, the only other thing I want to do today is give you some tips and advice. And today's tip is be selective with your photos. We all know we can all take hundreds, thousands of photos, but be selective. It's better to share 10 great shots than 100 average ones and in fact if you share in a, an album of, of loads of photos say 100 photos and there's only 10 in there that are world class they'll get lost within the album so you know don't over post just put out your very very best stuff um nothing but the best um and and one way you can work around that that i do is when we do burst modes continuous shooting and there's a sequence of, say, a player running down the wing, you might get eight or ten shots of it. Pick just one frame from that sequence to use. It can be impossible sometimes if it's a good sequence, but from each sequence you shoot, just, shoot, just pick one photo to work with. That's all for now. Please subscribe to the channel, comment, like, all that stuff. Um, it really helps me, and I'll speak to you next time.